Hello, today we're doing a video on best buys for cats. Now, number one best buy is a cat tree. Not just any old cat tree, a Pacific cat tree that I've brought 10 of. I haven't got one at the moment now because my cats get through it like something gone stupid. And at the moment now, they're attacking my settee. I've got all holes in my settee now. Uh, I'll put a picture of the cat tree that I had. It's the only one that I will buy. I won't buy any of the others. It's the only one that I will buy. And I'll put a picture of that cat tree or for you. Now, I've also got some new stuff because I've been B&M today and I've brought and I've been pets at home. Now do you know I've got some kittens. Um, I'm hoping this is going to be nice. I have got some but they're bigger so I'm hoping this one's a little bit smaller. The other one takes up the old back living room. So the second best buy for cats is this Kong brush. I mean, obviously, yeah, I've got tons and tons of brushes. You can have a little bit harder one if you, if you like. But I tend to have brought every brush going. Now, this is the best brush. And if you can stop mats in the first place, if you can, the cats love this. Absolutely love it. Now, all the other metal brushes that I've brought, yeah, the, yeah they're good, but you can just get a normal man's black comb and use that which is good if you've got any you know tougher knots here are my kittens coming on lovely so here we have the food maze this i like I really do like. Now there's two food stations what you can buy. I mean a normal bowl is just as good but these are really good if you want to go fancy. Now my cats love this. They will immediately go and eat out of this. They love this. Um, comes out easy to wash easy to clean um, and then just goes back in and the cats do love it this i have tried out with me cats and yes mine are enjoyed it does give them a little bit of um play time fun time as well uh, my cats do stick the paws through and go for it so this is good, I like this, um, gives them something to do. This I love, I love these, these are well worth the money, and believe me I've wasted tons of money, tons. And there's only uh, certain things that I now like. So that's the food stations, that's the brush, what do we do next? Hey, cats. Right. While we're getting good, we're still on the good stuff first. Right. So these, this. Can't beat these. Fantastic. There is a round one with a scratching thing in the middle and it goes round. I've had about ten of those and they've all worn out. They are absolutely fantastic. These are really good, really good for the cats, they love it, so I'll do the um, stuff that's a waste of space later. This is great, I think I got this on Sue Plus, right, um, I think there was mixed reviews on it, now this is to catch litter, right. Now I've had everything. I've had those big black mats, what you can buy. And they've been put in the garden and I thought I'd clean them later and I never ever got around to cleaning them. I don't like them, they're a waste of money. There's mixed reviews on this. I like it. The cats do walk on it. Um, if you put it next to the litter tray, you've got no choice. Now it does catch a little bit of litter. It does catch some, because 
I use wood based litter and I've constantly got to Uve and wipe everything down every day because my cats will tread it all through. This does catch some. This is better than those black mats what they've got me sell. So I've got two of these. So I do like those. That will go. I've just washed that. Oh, easy to wash as well. Everything has to be easy to wash, or else it just goes in the garden, forgotten about, and then that's it. My black mats are still at the back of the garden. Those are good. Easy to clean. I've got to go to my new stuff. Oh, here's my new stuff. I'll be doing that in a minute because I'm going to set that up for the kittens. This has been, this has been in my cupboard and my cats have not really used it. So I won't be buying another one. I've just pulled it out of my cupboard because I brought this ball. Uh, Zooplus is selling this ball. And I've got, they do prefer the round one and those others. I've got yet to see if they will play with it. I found that they didn't. Whether they will now put this ball in, I, don't, I do not know. Um, this wasn't played with. I'll see if they'll play with it with this new ball in it. Well, you're best off with the plain, simple ones. We all know that cats just want a good box as well. Anyway, you can play with this now. I've brought you a new ball to it. No. No, I just like plain and simple. And also, I don't know what this was for. I think this had fish in and you put water in. I don't know where the fish gone, I don't know where the rod's gone. So I now use these as a little toy box. These are fantastic. These are a good bag for cats. Brilliant, these balls. They love kicking them around. You cannot go wrong with these balls. They love them. They love them. Yeah, so I just use this in a little toy box now. It's was supposed to be a little swimming pool. This I brought them, they don't play with. Grace of space, never played with it. Never played with that at all. So that was a, this is good. Now this is a toy that I brought. Now they do play with this, but you can't go wrong with those balls. I, I mean, when I move my furniture to Uwe, they're everywhere. I think it's because they like that uh, ball. I think it's that ball. They love that ball. So I had to buy that ball separate from the toy. Um, because I lost the original ball and I thought I'd buy a light up one. And I opened the packet and let them play with it. And they've been playing with it around my living room and they absolutely love that ball. And now I've put it in the toy. Well, they're actually playing with it now. So I did buy this here, and um, the kittens have gone in it, but not much. I think I liked it more than what the cats do. Um, I don't know if it's because it's not sturdy and it moves, because cats do use the paws to see if something's sturdy enough. I've not seen any of my adult cats go in it. At the moment, that one's a... No, no. These are absolutely fantastic if you've got Sphinx. They go inside, keep warm. I've also brought me Sphinx 
uh, little kiddies sleeping bag and which my sphinx go inside and it keeps them warm and they absolutely love it they really love it and they my sphinx love those as well they go inside now if you've got indoor cats a cat enclosure is fantastic they can come in and out whenever they want to and uh, got little chairs in there for them and shelves which they love perching on and they can just go in and out when they want These are my daughter's kittens, I'm just uh, looking after them for it. So I've been past home today and I've brought this. Wow. Do you know, I didn't even look how much it was. I don't know. But, oh, I know how much it was. I brought it, there was a small one about this big and that was £9. And then this larger one was 12 for this larger one. So I thought, because I want it for going here, my pop-up tent for them, might as well pay £3 more and give them extra padding. Because I only needed that big, really. And here's my tent. So this was from B&M. Uh, that was from Pets. At home, pets at home. This is me little tent. It is tiny as well. Mind you, me, me others are too big. Oh, comes in a nice little bag. Oh, this is tiny. Yeah, kind of. What I wanted, well, it took the mat in though. Well, it took the mat in though. Actually, yeah, that's actually good. Because I only want the kittens and mum going in. So, that's actually, yeah. That's alright. I like it. Somewhere to keep them safe. It's got a lid so they can't get out. And it's, uh, yeah, somewhere to keep them safe. Oh, I do like it. I really do. I like that. And so, yeah, this is good for mummy and her newborn kittens. You know, somewhere to keep them safe, uh, especially if you've got grandkids, and to keep them contained and safe, and you know, so you don't tread on them or anything like that. You may need the next size up when they get a little bit bigger, but the bigger ones I usually put a litter box in and food and water, but that's great for newborns, not too big. There's mum feeding the kittens. This is another excellent buy. Don't bother go fancy all these furry ones and uh, these fancy ones with soft fur in. 
they end up in the garden and end up being chucked away. They get dirty, they get airs all over them. These simple. And I just stick this in the bath and wash it. Um, and then it's good to go again. Easy peasy. Make your life easy. Don't make your life hard. I've had, I think, absolutely about everything. I mean, I brought that over there and they prefer sitting in my grandson's chair. Let's go back to her feeding. So these are the best litter trays to buy. You can get them from B&M little plastic containers they come with a lid uh, but they are absolutely great for litter trays and they're a lot cheaper than uh, if you buy the normal litter trays Don't wash do you this is another brilliant litter tray this is fantastic uh, this has just come out to have a wash make sure you get plenty of these though because you'll need plenty of these to pull out and wash so it's coming handy if you've got loads of them. I think you can buy those separately. That's a brilliant litter tray, litter box. That's a brilliant litter box. So here's my green one. As you can see, the scratch part is all gone. But they still have that. But I still ordered that burgundy one. So That'll save you on eating bills. So it's calm. See ya. So let's open this, shall we? And it's got some catnip. Absolutely brilliant. I love it. I keep saying number one best toy. All these toys are <coughs> best toys to buy. Now for an elder cat, the best toy to buy for an older cat is a cat tree, obviously, with the three seats that I've already shown you. Three seats so they can sit up high. And also, see, most of these, majority of these toys are for kittens. But for the adult cat, don't really play. So what toy will get your adult cat's interest? One of these. These will get your adult cat. These are okay. These are okay. Uh, but I prefer this one. Now this will get your adult cat's interest. And I should actually say catnip and all. Oh, 
Okay, so for all the cats, catnip, one of these, and a large cat tree so they can go up high. They only need those things. And good food. And water. Definitely a scratch post. Definitely. So for the old cat, a cat tree with the three seats at the top if you've got more than one cat and one of these and catnip. 